put enough molly coat paste in the shaft upper thread and then put enough silicone paste or grease for spindle shaft and apply it evenly in the shaft. Next, put the purified bowel body above the shaft or the spindle. Then put the cap nut to the spindle. Use a torque wrench and put it in 50 newton meter to tighten the nut. Put the discharge slide using special tool. And put some white grease to the rectangular ring. Slowly put the discharge slide inside the bow using the special tool. And then remove the special tool. Clean and put the lock nut of the bowel body. Use a torque wrench and put it in 200 newton meter to tighten the locking device. As you tighten, make sure that the torque wrench will click at least two times. Remove the special tool for tightening. Put the disc stack assembly together with the distributor. Make sure that the slots in the bowl locking device and the distributor guide will meet. Now you can remove the lifting device of the disc stack assembly. Then put the inlet and outlet pipe to the top of the distributor. Make sure that all the o-rings are properly greased. Now put the top disc, just make sure that the slot in the distributor and the top disc will meet to ensure proper fitting. Compress it to ensure that it is properly fit. You can also refer to the numerical numbers to align it in the bow. Put the bow hood using the lifting device together with the lock ring. Make sure that the pin in the bow and the groove in the bow hood will meet as you compress it together. Put the three clamps for the lifting or compressing tool. Make sure that the bolts are fitted to the bow. Tighten the three bolts evenly to ensure proper compression with a torque of 40 newton meter or hand tight. Make sure that the lock ring is fitted between the bowl body and the bowl hood. Now you can remove the lifting device and the clamps.
make sure that the bowl is clean and there is no obstacles in the discharge port of the purifier. Put the purifier bowl cover. Put all the bolts of the bowl cover. And then tighten the bolts. Put the swing arm and spring of the pairing tube. And now, you can put the connection housing for the oil inlet and oil outlet pipe. Make sure it is properly fit. And for the last part, put the lock washer and lock nut using hook spanner. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.